guys, welcome back to another video when we're back in Dungeon Quest. So I'm going to be showing you where all the eggs are in Dungeon Quest, the secret eggs, and so you can get one of these lights. Honestly, I forgot what the light it is. Um, it's kind of confusing. They all kind of, um, since all the eggs look kind of, I think they're all a different color, and so it's kind of hard to know what one it is. But yeah, um, so it goes all the way up to Orbital Outpost right here. Um, so let's just get started right into Desert Temple. Honestly, it doesn't matter what mode it's on. It could be Insane, Nightmare, they're all there. Um, hopefully I'll just remember where they are. Uh, I haven't found these eggs in a long time because I've already looked for them. But at least they show you the eggs, even if you've gotten them before. I think they have. If not, I'll still just show you on it. Um, I'll still show you where they actually are. I did actually show where this was in my Noob to Godly series, but if you didn't watch that, so basically you spawn it in the middle, and you just run over to this uh, left back corner, and you go all the way over here, and yeah, it doesn't show, but you can see the light here, there's basically going to be a, um, uh, a, a golden egg right here, um, and then, yeah, basically that's going to be it. That's going to be the egg, you just collect it and then it'll explode on you. Alright, um, let's get back to the next area. Alright, so we're back in the lobby, and next is Winter Outpost. You can go on any difficulty. I actually don't remember this one fully. Um, I kind of remember what I'm looking for, but it was like the second area or something, I think, because this is the quickest map in the game, it's actually a really nice, um, area to grind in, um, definitely for lower levels, so, let's just get in, load, 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 alright, we're in, so let's go, so, um, I think we're looking for a house, I'll probably know the area once I get there, it's not the first, it's not in the first area like Desert Temple was. So you go past here, let's see. Um. Alright, I think it's the area, wait, no, no, no. It's the area, like, two after this, I think. Yeah, I think it's the area after this. Alright. So then this is like the fourth area? Okay, so you go until you see the house. That house over there. Alright, that looks kind of different from the last time I've been in or, um in this area. Alright. I'm just gonna kill those. So basically, you see this light here? Yeah, it's blue. It's a blue egg. It's basically going to be right behind this, um this house if you guys want me to make a video where i go on like an alt account so you guys can actually see the eggs oh that kind of might be oh yeah i'll go on one of my alt accounts i don't know if they are actually i have one i don't know if he's it's collected all of the eggs i think it's collected only a few um but it is a high level enough so it can like get through these dungeons um, maybe if i do my new yeah in my new to godly uh each two dungeon go in i'll like show you the egg and I'll collect it and stuff. Um, so, yeah, basically, the egg is right behind here. Okay, I'm just going to get into the next area. Alright, so next dungeon is Pirate Island. And we'll just go right into it. Alright, so this area is after... I think it's after the second boss is where it comes in. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. I think it's after the second boss. Kind of. Alright. Let's just start. So basically, what all these lights are going to be doing is... Honestly, we don't know yet, but... Um, it's going to be, like... Becoming, um... An Excalibur, apparently. It was supposed to be like a limited cosmetic that they were going to make just for all the people who got all the lights. But
but then like recently they stopped and they never like completed it because there's still one light left that people need to get and i think they just gave up i honestly don't know um well i didn't notice he just had eyes yeah i'm going to make a video on it anyways so uh, if you guys don't want to like, if you guys didn't hear this one, I'll just explain it all in the next uh, video, I guess. I'll probably, it'll probably be the next video I'll make. Alright, so basically, after first boss, you come down here to the mobs, and you just go into this hole over here. Um, basically, yeah. And I think this, I don't know what, I think this is gold color egg, probably. I mean, it looks kind of gold, but I guess it's kind of green too. Yeah, it might be a green egg, too. Um, yeah, basically, the egg's here. It's going to explode. Blah, 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 that stuff. Alright, uh, let's go to the next dungeon. Alright, so the next dungeon is King's Castle. Alright, I'm gonna speed up this one because the egg is right in next to boss, the boss, the last boss. And so it's probably going to take a while. Alright, I decided not to time lapse it. I was too lazy. But yeah, here's the boss. We're here. Just gotta go all the way up here. Um gotta be careful not to use my speed spell on him. Alright, I'm just using a weapon because sometimes the mobs are really tiny and they're hard to hit. Um with my spell, so I just hit them back. Alright, so the egg is right here. I think it's red. You can kinda see the tilt tilt to it. Sorry, that's the boss ability. Um, that's why it's really dark right now. But the egg is right here behind this chair. Okay, I'm just gonna kill the boss for good measure. Let's see the loot we get. Nope, trash. Wait, is that a collectible? Wow, that's a collectible. That's nice. At least it's, but it's only green, so it's not really that good. All right, next, on to the next dungeon. <laughs> Guys, the next world is Underworld. Um, I don't fully know where this one is. I think I remember the general area. Honestly, I haven't looked up any of where these were. So the last time I've done like found these is probably like a year ago. Um, so you pass the first area. Uh, you get into this area. I know it's somewhere in here. In the first round room because there's multiple so the first round room and I think it's by one of these poles uh oh yeah yeah so on this pole you go in the, it um and it's like basically see-through so you come this way you go all the way to the far pole not the first one by the door but the other one and you come here it's probably a red egg seeing by the aura it gives off but it'll just be right here, collect it, and poof, there you get it. Alright, on to the next dungeon. Alright guys, the next area is Samurai Palace. Um, don't mind who's with me, um, he was just somebody looking for a carry, so I just decided to carry him. Um, while I still had the chance. So basically, you're going to have to do, this is one pretty far in the dungeon, it's after second boss. Um, so, yeah, hold on, I'm gonna get there real quick, and I'll meet back. So the next dungeon is um, the canals, and personally, a favorite dungeon of mine. And this one's really close to the spawn. Uh, you just defeat these mobs, and you shimmy your way through here. Um, normally, it wouldn't be this bright for you, I don't think. It's just that my cosmetic is pretty bright. But the egg is right here. See, if I take off my um, cosmetics and stuff. 
Hold on, did it work? Alright, wait, hold on. Oh, if I just put my thing in here, that's the lightning, I think. But, um, yeah, the egg is right there. Um, I'm pretty sure it's white. Alright, on to the next dungeon. Alright guys, if you watched the entire time skip thingy, you'd see we made it all the way here. It's um, right before final boss, which is right up there. And you basically just need to skip these mobs. After I show this egg, though, I'll probably complete the dungeon just to see if I get lucky on any loot. But yeah, so you make your way, when you go across the chain, you just make your way to this sandy beach over here. And you go through this totally not mysterious cave. Uh, and, yeah, it should basically be right here. Uh, if I go away, yeah, it has a glow over here. So, the egg will be right here if you just, um, click it. And, let me just complete the dungeon real quick. Let's see our luck. Um, also, let me know if you're actually liking these dungeon quest videos. I know probably our channel has been, like, all, um minecraft videos and like normally um not really well not just one game in particular like all these dungeon quest videos i'm making now but i just think this is a really nice game and anybody can play it it's really fun all right uh trash trash loot i think yeah it's all bad all right next dungeon Alright, so this is a steampunk sewers dungeon, um, if you guys can already tell. So basically, um, you have to go all the way to the last boss, which you see. You'll know it's the last boss when it appears on your screen. Basically, you're just gonna walk down these stairs, just go right underneath them. Um, if you first try to find it, um, it's not at the very front. You have to go all the way into the back area. Um, and then the egg should be right here. I think it's green. I mean, it, it looks like it's supposed to be throwing off a green scent. And, but honestly, I feel like, um, this egg should be yellow. Like this type of yellow. Yeah, um, I don't know if, I think the other side works too. Yeah, um, you can always go on the other side if you want. Let's just see our loot look. Uh, I can't really get much good stuff from this because I already have the cosmetic and stuff. Oh, uh, well, nothing good. What the heck is that? That's kind of weird. Alright, next dungeon. Alright, guys. I'm going to quickly carry this dude, but once I get back, I'm going to, um, continue with the thingy and explain things. So, hold on. 
All right, I got back from the carry. Um, hold on, I just gotta give him the loot real quick. Oh, I kind of forgot his username. Uh, oh yeah, while I'm waiting for him, um, so basically the next dungeon is technically after Steampunk Sewers. It's technically boss raids, but boss raids doesn't have a um doesn't have like an egg and so since there's like multiple different maps you would need to like get really lucky on the type of map you're on and so basically there's like hold on um, I'm trying to focus on giving him this stuff Yeah, so boss raids, there's no egg in there, and so, um, so you basically skip it, and you just go on to Orbital Outpost, which is technically the last, um, technically the last place that has an egg. So, yeah, basically that's where we're gonna go. Let's go... Yeah, I'm not gonna like pause and like skip to it because it's basically literally in this picture. It's right there behind that wall. Yeah, it's really close to spawn. I'm also sorry if this video isn't helpful since you're not really at these high dungeons, but um, eventually grinding, you can always like go on um, Discord and go on the Discord server and they've got um, people who carry and stuff. I think I've never really done it because I didn't get the Discord server for this when I was actually in the low level. Alright, so um, I'm not really sure where the egg is in here. I, th I thought it was behind that wall, but I don't really see a glow over here. But yeah, basically the egg is somewhere over here. You'll probably see it. I think it's behind one of these two walls, but I can't really remember. Yeah, I think it's behind that wall. Is that's where I remember. All right, so that's the last egg um, location. Yeah, and once you get them all, you're going to get a light. The light is probably not gonna do anything. I think Dungeon Quest really gave up on that thing. Um, like doing the Excalibur quest and stuff. They, I think they gave up on it. But honestly, it's great to like have all the eggs. Um, just while we're on this topic, I'm probably going to make a video on this anyways, in case somebody didn't watch all the way this far. But, um, another way to get one of the lights, um, and you also get this as a determined title, is if you get three cosmetics, like dropping three cosmetics from a dungeon. So, as an example, I have it. Um, and the armors I've gotten from a dungeon are the Lava Demigod, which is from Volcanic Chambers. I've also gotten the Aventor from Steampunk Sewers and Demon Lord from Underworld. Those are three drops that you can get. Um, it doesn't work if you go to Egg Island, at least I don't think, because Egg Island has four cosmetics. I don't think it actually works. Um, I've never actually tried because I think I got the determined title before I got them. But I don't think it does because it's not technically a dungeon because it's pretty easy to defeat. I can always make a video on how to like get those cosmetics if you want to know because you don't actually need to be a high level. Alright, we got nothing good. Alright, so that's basically all for today's video. Um, I hope this guys this helped you guys out a little bit maybe for future. You can always look later at this video and not pick any else's but mine to watch yeah um I'll see you guys in the next um uh, probably dungeon quest video honestly that's the one i'll probably be making on most all right guys oh, sorry i just yawned i don't know what that sounded like in the recording but all right see you guys